everyone, my name is Marcy and this is Sassmaster and you're at Williamson County Animal Center. Sassmaster came in just yesterday afternoon with a litter of uh, three siblings. Um, very unique, unusual looking kittens. Um, we weren't even really sure what they were, uh, but we do know for sure that they're polydactyl. I don't know if you can see her little paws, but this cat has six or seven paw or little pads on his little feet. And he has a fluffy coat, and it's this beautiful, uh, like, shaded. He's almost white with brown stripes. I mean, just the most unique, unusual-looking kitten I've ever seen. And I'm sorry he's climbing up here. He's a little nervous. They just came in yesterday, and they've been kind of poked and prodded, and he's just ready to get back in his little corner. Um, <clears throat> Now, only two of these kittens are left, and their adoption fee is uh, $50 with a $50 spay-neuter deposit that is refundable uh, when they come back to get neutered. So I just wanted to let you know that we have some beautiful, <laughs> unique kittens here, folks. So you should come and see Little Sass Master. Hi, everyone. This is Brownie. Brownie is a beagle, uh, I think coonhound mix that came to us, gosh, just two days ago. Um, his family had to give him up because I guess he didn't think too kindly of the husband. <laughs> but he has just been a really sweet dog here. He's super friendly. He's been jumping on everyone and greeting them and saying hello. Um, he's about three years old and he's already neutered. We have him up to date on all of his vaccinations. Um, he has not been around uh, children or dogs or cats. Uh, evidently, he must have been the only pet in the household. Now, I did take him past some of our shelter kitties, and one of them really puffed up, and he backed up. So I think he probably has a healthy respect for cats. So he might do okay with a, with a kitty in the family. Um, also, because he is a, a hound, he has the tendency to want to follow his nose. So I would definitely recommend a home with a fenced-in backyard uh, to help to keep him confined. Of course, he'd also probably really like to have some long walks too. So we would love for you to please come and see sweet, friendly Brownie.